So with only four outs left for the Warhawks to come back, the score is still 2-1, favoring the Titans. Yeah, Nick Santoro has eight career home runs, not known for his uh, big power, so he was able, so uh, he wasn't able to get a hold of one, wasn't able to tie the score with one swing of the bat, but now Brian Sturdivant comes up. Brian Sturdivant had a pretty good first game himself, looking to continue that in the bottom of the eighth. He'll take a pitch for ball one. Good patience there, trying to find something that he likes, just trying to put a ball on play here. Mulvahill from the stretch. That one will be hit into right field, finds a gap, Sturdivant rounding first, outfielder tripping against the wall, and that will go in for a stand-up double. Brian Sturdivant with a key hit there. Yeah, opposite field poked it into uh, poked it down the first base line into right field, and he was able to uh, get get those long strides moving, and he was able to uh, walk in for a stand up double. And with two outs here in the bottom of the eighth, the Warhawks finding some life here, just trying to get something to go. And who better to give the bat to than Ryan Norton? One for three on the day. He's been pretty consistent today behind the plate as a catcher. This would be perfect for him to get something to play. Mulvahill with the pitch. Swung on and missed by Ryan Norton. Oh, but again, he's got to be patient at the plate. He's got to make sure that he waits for his pitch. Uh, he can't pounce on anything uh, anything right away. He's got to be uh, patient, have a good eye, and find something he likes. Mulvahill looking down at the catcher. Checks back to second a few times here. He'll wind up and throw the pitch. That one is smacked to left field. Get out of here. Gone. A two-run shot for Ryan Norton. All the way back towards the 367 mark of the outfield, and this game has changed. I was thinking it. I was feeling it. He could have he blasted one in the second game for Stevens Point, and now he comes up huge. The bench loves it. An amazing shot. And again, Whitewater now pulls in front three to two. What an amazing, amazing hit by Ryan Norton. Now two home runs on the year. And again, maybe he can be that big power hitter that you can lean on as a catcher. Filling the shoes of Mike Aiello. What a bomb that was. <laughs> wow, I'm still astounded over here just watching how how high that hit was. Hitting the two-run homer. Now Jacob DeMeyer at the plate as he'll swing for strike one, but wow, what a home run. Absolutely clutch by Ryan Norton. Talk about critical juncture of a game. Comes up huge. Both catchers standing out in this game, Zach Taylor and Ryan Norton. Coming up with home runs. Swinging really hard and missing is Jacob DeMeyer. 2-3 game here. Warhawks up by one. And Cameron Mulvahill only giving four hits so far as that one is shot right back towards the shortstop and that will go down as a ground, on the ground as a single and another player getting on base for the Warhawks. Yeah, Jacob DeMeyer has done that throughout the game today. He has been the impact player in the nine hole. Great job, great piece of hitting by there by DeMeyer, ripping it right back up the middle, and Whitewater's got a runner on board. 